eraser app select the picture that we want to use then we're going to click that eraser button and then since my background is one color I just click the target color and then we save that picture go into our internet click um, find a picture that you want to use as your background I decided I wanted to use a glittery background so then I put it back in the eraser app um, I just took out that white background so it's transparent now and then we're going to save that and then we're going to go into our Fonto app so now you're going to click on plain image, you're going to customize the size so it's 800 by 800 and then you're going to save that image and you're going to use it. And then now you're just going to go into your camera roll and you're going to select the background image first that you wanted to use that you got and then you're going to layer on top of that background image the picture that you want to use on your, um, the picture you want to use on your on your watermark so now after that then you just adjust the size of the picture and then I'm gonna go in and add the text that I want to add the text is absolutely optional you don't have to add text if you don't want to but I just wanted to make sure I put my my name on there because I'm also going to use the watermark for pictures and when I'm posting on different social media accounts as well so after that, then I'm just going to just fix up the size, put strokes and change the color of the text a little bit. Just make it to my liking. Again, the text is optional. You don't have to. But if you do want to add the text, you can put like your YouTube name, your social media names. You can put subscribe. You can say whatever you want is yours. Go crazy. So now I decided to go just a little step further and go ahead and stretch the words just to put a little bit of spacing in between them so that they're not so close together because with the text font that I used, it was really close together. So now we're just going to go ahead and save that picture one more time, go back into our eraser app, and we're going to take out that white background. But since when I took out the white background, it kind of made the glitter look very dull. So I just went back in and filled in the, the white spots on the glitter, which really took a long time. So we're just gonna, I sped up through it as much as possible because I wanted to get those white spots but not bring in that white border back. Alright guys, so now that I like how it came out, I'm going to go ahead and save that photo and then I'm going to head over into my Safari. I'm going to go to YouTube.com and it's going to pull up as the mobile version of YouTube, 
but once you're there you switch over to the desktop version of youtube so that you can go ahead and upload your watermark or you can do this from your computer if you feel more comfortable with that so once you are on the desktop version of YouTube, you're going to go ahead and go to Creator Studio. You can't do it in the YouTube beta studio yet, so you have to go to the regular Creator Studio. Then you're going to go down and you're going to click on Channel. And then under Channel, it's going to say Branding. And then under Branding, you just click on that. And then you just, it's either going to give you the option to upload or replace if you already have a watermark on your channel already. So once you do that, you're gonna go into your gallery, select the picture that you wanna use, and mine came out as a square instead of the transparent one because the transparent kept telling me it was the wrong size, but when I did it on the computer, it came out the right size. So if, it's if, you give if you're having that problem, then you might need to do it from your computer instead of doing it from your mobile device. So once I did that, I saved it and I uploaded it, and then I just switched I checked the settings so instead of having it play at a certain time in my video I just decided to have it play throughout the whole video so I clicked the entire video and then that was it all right guys thank you for watching um, don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this video if you want to see more content like this and don't forget to give it a thumbs up